Activate Flippy Station. It's time, get up and shout. I wonder what we'll learn about Flippy Wonders. <laughs> I hope Grandpa Blippy gets his birthday card in time. Hmm, I wonder, how does a letter get to where it needs to go? Great idea, Debo. We'll shrink down and follow the letters to find out. I'm gonna need wings. Wings confirmed. Shrinking down! The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure. I wonder where all these letters and postcards are going. Whoa! Hi there, I'm Lana the Letter. Hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. <coughs> Lana, we're wondering, how do letters like you get to where you need to go? <coughs> Whoa! What's happening? We're moving one step closer to our destinations. <laughs> Just stick with me. <coughs> Whee! Ooh. Ooh. Everybody, hold on! We're in for a bumpy ride! Lana, where are we going? We're being transported! Whoa! To Grandpa Blippi's mailbox? Not just yet. We're at... Oof. The post office! Whoa! The post office! So cool! Whoa! Oof. Now... It's time for us to get sorted. Sorted? How? First, by size. Just think like a letter, Blippi. Huh, yeah. Wee <laughs> Once us letters and packages are sorted by size, we are sorted to face the same way. Woo! Hey, that tickles. And then the letters are scanned for their stamps. Oh, no. But what if I don't have a stamp? I got you covered. Yay. Wait, where's Debo? <laughs> He's probably enjoying the ride, just like us. There you are, Debo. Where are we going now? To the mail truck! <laughs> hey, the truck takes every letter to the exact mailbox it needs to be delivered to. So cool! Next stop, Grandpa Blippi's house! Whee! Bye, Lana. Thanks for helping us get around the post office. Bye, Blippi and Debo! What have we got here? A birthday card from Blippi? Hot dog! Aw, he loves it! And I got the answer to my question. A letter gets to where it needs to go by being dropped in a mailbox, transported to the post office, sorted, then delivered by a mail truck. Upload answer, Debo. <laughs> Woohoo! You can't catch me, Mika! Oh, yeah? Look out for my ultimate cartwheel! Here I come! Whoa! whoa Watch out! Whoa! 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 A secret clearing! You're right, Tabs and Debo. This does look like a perfect spot for a playground. Hmm, I wonder, what would it be like to build the ultimate Blippi playground? Great question! Let's design it and build it. All right. First, we need a big play structure. Maybe it can look like a rocket. That's a great idea, Mika. It's going to need lots of shade. Looking great, Debo and Tabs. Hmm. Next, we'll need a zip line. Whee! <laughs> oh, yeah! And a musical bridge. Yeah! Oh, wow! We 
definitely need a slide. All right. Whoa! Whee! Yeah! Uh-oh, Blippi! Looks like a storm is brewing! Five minutes until rain! Oh, no! We better hurry. How about a racetrack? Four minutes until rain! We definitely need a stage. Whoa! Whoa! Three minutes until rain! We definitely need a splash pool. Two minutes until rain! Ow! And we definitely need a, a ball pit! pit. Oh, wow! Yikes! One minute to rain! Take cover, everyone! Whoa! We did it! Yar! I'm Captain Blippi. Let's set sail for the open seas. Yar! Aye, aye, Captain! Whoa! 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 <laughs> hmm, something is missing. That's it! <coughs> it's perfect! And I have the answer to my question. What's it like to build the ultimate Blippi playground? It's Blippi-tastic! Upload answer, Debo and Tabs. Awesome work, everyone! This calls for a celebration! Yeah! Nice catch, Debo. Do you hear that? That's one cool beat. I can't stop moving. <laughs> hmm, I wonder, why does music make us want to dance? Hi, Blippi. Hi, Mika. Hey, Benjamin. That was some pretty sweet beatboxing you were doing. Yeah, it made me want to dance. Hey, Benjamin, do you know why music makes us want to move our bodies and dance? I sure do. Just shrink down to my size, and I'll show you. All right. Shrinking down. Awesome. Now we're ready to party. Yeah. Hit it, DJ D-Bops. When we hear music, we enjoy the sound of it. This beat makes me want to move my feet. I love this song. And our bodies want to explain how the noise is being made. So we move in a way that matches the rhythm. On the beat. Woo, a classical song. Love your moves, Blippi. Check out yours, Mika. <laughs> Now we've got the same moves. Together. Woohoo! Hey, DJ D Bops, pick up that tempo! Flippy, I challenge you to a dance off! It's on! Dance on! Go, Flippy! Go, Flippy! Break it down, Mika! Woo hey! Oh. Uh -huh. Woo Feel the groove! Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Woo All right! Yeah. I'm having so much fun! This beat has a nice ring. It makes me want to sing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I almost forgot.
forgot one more thing about dancing. What is it? That it's super fun. Oh, yeah. It's a blast. <laughs> Thanks for answering my question, Benjamin. Music makes us want to dance because our bodies want to match the beat. It's a great way to connect with friends. And it's so much fun. Upload answer, Debo. <laughs> Who's ready for a dance off? Round two. <laughs> it's on. Dance on. <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> That one is red, Tabs. Oh, and that one is green. Hmm, I wonder, why are fireworks different colors? Great idea, Tabs. Let's go investigate. I'm gonna need helicopter blades and a grabber arm. Helicopter blades, grabber arm, confirmed. Activate Blippi Station. Shrinky down! The Flippy Mobile is ready for adventure! Oh, no, 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 no! Never get too close to fireworks! Be safe! Give them some space! Okay! Hey! It's me, Flippy, and this is Tax. We were just wondering how fireworks get their colors. Hi, I'm Penny. I'll spin you a tale all about it. Whee! First, you have to know that fireworks are little rockets filled with black powder, which burns fast and sends the fireworks as high as a thousand feet into the air. Whoa, that's pretty high. Good idea, Tabs. Let's get a better look at the fireworks in the sky. Will you join me in the Blippi Mobile, Penny? Sure. Whoa! Great. Even in the air, remember to stay safe and give them space. So colorful. Packed into the top of the firework are metal salts called stars. Just like different foods have different flavors when you eat them, different metal salts burn different colors when you ignite them. Watch out! Here comes another one, Tabs! Are you okay? I told you, stay safe and give them space. We should get down to the ground or we'll all miss the big ending. You're right, let's go. <gasps> Here it comes, the grand finale. What an amazing show! And now I have the answer to my question. Why are fireworks different colors? Fireworks are different colors because of the different metal salts they burn. Upload answer tabs. Bye, Penny. Bye, Flippy. Always stay colorful. What's making that sound? Oh, it's a race car. It's going so fast. You're right. The Blippi Mobile could never go that fast. Hmm, I wonder, why are race cars so much faster than regular cars? Good idea, Debo. We can go to the racetrack and find out. I'm gonna need race car tires. Race car tires confirmed. Activate Blippi Station. The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure. Hi! Are you here to try out the 
Rice Crack? Hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. We're actually here to find out why race cars are so much faster than regular cars. Hi, I'm Ricardo. Let me show you on the track. Let's race. All right. Before we race, I have a really important job for you, Debo. I need you to be the captain of the pit stop. During the race, I'll pull in here so you can keep me in tip-top shape. Can you help out and do that job? <laughs> nice try, Debo. But what you'll be doing is gassing up my tank and swapping out my tires. Okay, race time! Helmets on and buckle up! Whoa! I'm going really fast! Whoa! I'm not even going as fast as I can! Only 180 miles per hour now! Race cars are made out of a lighter material than regular cars, plus my shape helps me race easier into the wind. It's called aerodynamics. You and my Blippi Mobile are definitely different shapes. Pit stop, Captain! Do your thing! You can do it, Debo! Ricardo, do you have special tires? I do! My tires are wider and softer than regular car tires, so I can go even faster on this super hot track! Thanks, Debo! Now you're even faster! My powerful engine is five times stronger than a regular car's. I can reach my top speed of 220 miles per hour. See you at the finish line, Blippi! Whoa! I'm blown away! But now I have the answer to my question. Why are race cars so much faster than regular cars? It's because race cars are aerodynamic and made out of a lighter material, have special tires to race on the hot track, and a super powerful race car engine! Huh? Upload answer, Debo. Bye-bye, <laughs> Ricardo! Bye, Blippi! Bye, Debo! Ciao! <laughs> You're right, Debo. It would be fun to have a dinosaur as a pet. Hmm, I wonder, would a dinosaur make a good pet? Good thinking. We'll go back in time to find out. I'm gonna need the grabber arm and monster truck wheels. Grabber arm, monster truck wheels, confirmed. Activate Blippi Station! <laughs> Going back in time! The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure! That's right! We're in the Cretaceous period. Millions of years ago, when the Earth was filled with... Dinosaurs! Hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. Hi there, Blippi! I'm Tina, the Tyrannosaurus Rex. Hi, Tina. We were wondering, would a dinosaur make a good pet? An animal that you love and care for. Wow, being a pet sounds amazing. Maybe I could be your pet for the day. Can you drop Debo, please? Debo's made a metal, and we don't want you to break a tooth. Good, Dino. We sure do have sharp teeth. I use mine to eat. Whoa! Do you eat a lot? Feeding is an important part of having a pet. I can bite off 500 pounds of food in one jump. That's a lot more than I have here. Hmm. Let's try a trick. Great idea, Debo! Go fetch, Tina! Whoa! Whoopsies! 
Sometimes I forget my size. Us T-Rexes can be as tall as 12 feet high and up to 40 feet long. Wow, that's so big. <coughs> hey, let's go for a walk, Tina. Whoa, look at all of those teeth. Something tells me that's not how a walk is supposed to go. We gave it a try, but I'm not sure if dinosaurs are meant to be pets. I think you're right. We're meant to rule the jungle. Yep, and you helped find the answer to my question. Would a dinosaur make a good pet? Dinosaurs are big, have lots of teeth, need room to roam, and eat a lot. So they might not be good pets, but it's still fun to imagine. Upload answer, Debo. Bye bye Tina. Bye. Come back in time. Any time. <laughs> Last one to splash has to take out the trash. <laughs> Wait, worms! Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> hmm, I wonder, why do worms come out in the rain? I'm gonna need pontoons and the excavator arm. Pontoon, excavator arm, confirmed. Activate Flippy Station. Shrinky down! The Flippy Mobile is ready for adventure! La 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 la! Ooh, what's that? La 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 la! Whoa! Hey, it's me, Flippy, and this is Debo. <laughs> oh, hi! I'm Wave the Worm, and I la 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 love singing! Everybody join in! La la la. I wish I could find another worm I could sing with. Well, I'd ask you, but you're not worms. But hey, enough about me. What can I do for you? We were wondering why worms come up from underground when it rains. There are three reasons. Follow me, 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 me. Worm dive. Huh? Whoa! It sounds like something's digging down. It's getting closer. Don't worry. That's just the raindrops hitting the ground above and sending vibrations down. But to us worms, it sounds like a predator trying to dig down and get us. So that's one reason we go topside. Whoa! What? We better get out of here! Wave? Hello? La 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 You're right, Debo. That does look like fun. Reason number two. When it rains, we worms can move around on the ground much faster. That's right, Debo. Wave did say there are three reasons why worms come out in the rain. What's the third reason, Wave? Third reason? Um. La, 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 la. Oh, that's right. Number three, to find a friend. I love the rain. I love the rain too. We love the rain. Wave, you found a friend who loves to sing just like you. And now I have the answer to my question. Why do worms come out in the rain? Worms come out in the rain because the raindrop vibrations sound like predators. They can travel more quickly when it's wet and to find a special friend. Upload answer, Debo. Goodbye, Blippi. Goodbye, Debo. La 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 la. <laughs> bye bye, Wave. Thanks for all your help. <laughs> Look at all the blinking fireflies! 
One, two, three. One, two, three. Oh, I love counting. Don't you, Debo? <laughs> hey, get back here, you silly. What you got there, Debo? Hmm, I wonder, why do fireflies light up? I'm gonna need wings. Wings confirmed. Activate Blippi Station. Shrinking down! The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure. Look at all those different flashing patterns. Maybe it's a counting game. One, two, three. One, two, three. Whoa! <laughs> Whoops. Hey, it's me, Blippi. I was wondering, why do fireflies light up? Hey, I'm Felicia. And if there's one thing you gotta know about us fireflies, it's that we are all about that blink. One, two, three. One, two, three. You again? <laughs> Just try and catch me this time. Debo! <laughs> I like your style, Debo. I've never seen moves like that. One, two, three. One, two, three. When fireflies blink, it's because they like another firefly style. And with style like that, I just can't stop. Everybody, stop! Oh, no! Not today, froggy boy! Felicia saves the day. <sighs> Works every time. Fireflies also light up when there is danger around. Oh, like a warning signal to predators to stay away? Yep. Nope, not my style. Not bad, but nah. Hey, Blippi, will you help me find a firefly with a blinking style like mine? You mean like a counting game? Yeah. Do you remember my flash pattern? One, two, three. One, two, three. That's it! We found your match! Now that's my style. <laughs> what a great adventure! And I got the answer to my question. Why do fireflies light up? Fireflies light up to warn predators to stay away and to help them find other fireflies with the same blinking style. Upload answer, Debo. Thanks for your help, Blippi! Bye, Felicia! One, two, three! One, two, three! Whoa! Look at all those elephants! Hmm, I wonder, what do elephants use their trunks for? You're right, Debo. We should go ask one and find out. I'm gonna need a water hose and duck feet. Water hose, duck feet, confirmed. Activate Flippy Station. <laughs> the Flippy Mobile is ready for adventure. <laughs> Yikes! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! 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 Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Yeah! Hey! It's me, Blippi, and that's Debo. Hey, we were wondering, what do elephants use their trunks for? Hi, Blippi and Debo. I'm Tempo. We elephants use our trunks to help cool down by sucking up water and spraying it on our body. Like this? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go down the slide again. Race you to the show! You're on! First! Whoa! <laughs> 
Whoa! How can you breathe underwater? That's another great thing about my trunk. I can breathe through it. Wow! Just like my nose. <coughs> exactly. Hey, speaking of noses, I smell bananas. Elephants have an excellent sense of smell. Come on, hop on my back. Oh, boy! Another slide! I wish we could go down that one, but the path is blocked! Check this out! Another great thing about trunks is that I can move just about anything! Last one down is a banana peel! Whoa! This is the best day ever! Whoa! Ready or not? also use their trunks to make sounds, like when we are excited. That's amazing! <laughs> Thank you, Tembo, for helping me find the answer to my question. What do elephants use their trunks for? Elephants use their trunks to smell, breathe, make sounds, suck up water, and even grab things. <laughs> Upload answer, Devo. Bye, Blippi. See you next time you're in the savannah. Bye-bye. <laughs> we had such a blast! You look like a fireman! Now you look like a construction worker! <laughs> You're a natural cowboy, Debo! <laughs> hmm, I wonder, what is it like to be a cowboy? Let's find out! I'm gonna need a grabber arm! Grabber arm. Confirmed. Activate Flippy Station. The Flippy Mobile is ready for adventure. Uh, uh, hey, do you know any cowboys? Whoa, Whoa there. <laughs> Howdy, I'm Hampton the Hulk. What brings you two down to these for? Hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. We're here to learn what it's like to be a cowboy. Well, you certainly rode into the right range. Giddy up. But first, we've got to get you looking the part. All right. I see you got your hat on, partner. Looking good. <laughs> here, Blippi, grab yourself a hat and a bandana. See, cowboys wear these wide brim hats to protect themselves from the sun and the rain. Ah, much better. Now you looking good. Yeah, cowboy! But they're also useful for gathering water when you need a drink. Cool! Ooh! Whoa! Uh oh! <laughs> Whoopsie! Uh, cowboy hats are also good for moving a cow in the right direction. Yeah! Here you go. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> hey! No worries there, Blippi. Being a cowboy is so much more than just having the right clothes. Like what? Riding horses is a big part of the job. It's how cowboys got around before corn, and it allows us to herd cattle without scaring. Hop on. Let's ride! Maybe we should slow down. Oh, I think I'll stick to the Blippi Mobile. <laughs> That's actually perfect, since we have loose cattle to rank. We gotta spread out and move in the direction for the cows to go toward the pen. Yeah. Ah, this way. Let's get a wiggle on. That means let's go. Yippee! <laughs> well done, Blippi. 
You wrangled those cows like a real cowboy. Being a cowboy is hard work. Sure is. But it makes the day worthwhile. <laughs> yeah. Thanks for helping me find the answer to my question. <laughs> Cowboys wear big hats, ride horses, and wrangle cattle. Upload answer, Debo. <laughs> Thanks for making us feel at home on the range. Anytime, City Slicker. <laughs> Tabs? It's an adorable kitty cat. <laughs> and look at those super long whiskers. Hmm, I wonder, why do cats have whiskers? Great idea, Tabs. Let's follow that kitty cat and find out. I'm gonna need wings. Wings confirmed. Activate Flippy Station. Ready for adventure! Do you see any kitties yet, Tabs? Whoa! What was that? Hey! It's me, Flippy! What's your name? Hippley's the name, and treats are my game! Say, you aren't holding out on me, are you? <laughs> Holding out on what? Treats. I can smell them like hot cakes in the morning. They're close. Hurry, follow me. Wait for me. <laughs> Yeehaw! Woo! Flawless. How do you land so perfect? My whiskers have special sensors that help keep me oriented, so I always land on my feet. Like this! Ha -ha. Do you think you can fit? My whiskers help me determine if I can fit through the passage without getting stuck. See? I told you. <clears throat> Come on, Blippi! It's so dark! How can you see anything? When I can't see what's around me, my whiskers tell me when something's there. Ah, oh, rats! No treats in here. But we must be close. Come on, y'all! What else can your whiskers do? Even the slightest breeze can tell me information about my environment and what direction a smell is coming from. My whiskers are telling me that the treats are... Woo! There! Woo! Snackpot! <laughs> Would you look at that? Woo-hoo-hoo! I'm happier than a pig in mud! What a great adventure, Kipley! We found the treats! And I got the answer to my question. Why do cats have whiskers? Cats' whiskers help them navigate their environment and help them keep oriented so they always land on their feet. Upload answer tabs. Bye bye Kipley! Thanks, Bliffy. It was great to have you as a sidekick on this adventure. Bye, y'all! Ready, Debo? <laughs> Three, two, one! Yeah, it's not quite what I envisioned. I wish I could make a few changes. <gasps> oh, yeah! I can use an eraser! Hmm, I wonder, how does an eraser work? Great idea, Debo! We'll shrink down and get a closer look. I'm gonna need a grabber arm and helicopter blades. Grabber arm, helicopter blades, confirmed. Activate Blippi Station. <laughs> Shrinking down! The Blippi Mobile is 
ready for adventure. Hmm, even up close, it sure does need some changes. Maybe I can help. Huh? I am the amazing Ernie. Hey, it's me, Blippi. And this is Debo. We're here to learn how an eraser works. Well, you came to the right eraser because I can make anything disappear. Even pencil markings. That's amazing. Come see, it's the best show in town. The tip of a pencil is made of graphite, and when you rub it on paper, it leaves a mark. Cool. Uh -huh. Let's take a closer look through a magnifying glass. Graphite gets left behind on the paper because it actually sticks to the paper. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, no. Huh? I got it. Phew. That was close. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> hey, Ernie, can you erase this graphite mark? Oh, what a great idea! I will make that mark disappear by erasing it. When an eraser like me rubs against the paper, it creates friction and heat. Awesome! The heat makes the eraser stickier than the paper, so the graphite comes loose from the paper and sticks to the eraser instead. Friction also causes the eraser to disintegrate or fall apart. See the small bits coming off? <laughs> You've got a few on you. Oh, they're cute. Wrap the eraser on the paper enough, and boy, oh boy, the graphite comes off. Ta-da! My disappearing act. Oh, that's amazing. Was it magic? No, it's science. Cool. And I got the answer to my question. How does an eraser work? Erasers work by using friction to make them stickier than paper. So the graphite on the paper clings to the eraser. Upload answer, Debo. <laughs> Thanks for the magic show, Ernie. Now it's time for us to disappear. Goodbye, Blippi. It was magic to meet you. <laughs> oh, no. Debo. Look how the water is carrying the frisbee far away towards that island. Hmm, I wonder, why don't islands float away? You're right. Let's go ask the island and find out. I'm gonna need helicopter blades and duck feet. Helicopter blade, duck feet confirmed. Activate Blippi Station. The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure. Oh, hello up there. Hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. <laughs> nice to meet you both. I'm Ivan. Ivan, why don't you float away? Hmm, I think it has something to do with my bottom. Oh, I know. Let's look underwater where my bottom is to find out. Oh, wait. I can't see down there. You're right, Debo. It would be great if you sucked up the water so we could see the bottom better. I can't wait to see what's down there. Okay, Debo. Drink up. <laughs> wow! These colorful coral reefs are so beautiful. We can see so much now. And Ivan, you're way bigger than I thought. Thanks. I'm even bigger. You're only at my belly button now, see? Oh, Debo, can you drink up more water so we can see the bottom? Are you okay, Debo? <laughs> Ivan, you have so many amazing things on you. Hey, wait! Are we at the bottom now? 
No! You have reached my knees! Still a bit of a way to go! Do you think you've got one more big gulp left in you, Devo? We're so close to being able to see the bottom! Woohoo! I knew you did! You made it, Flippy! <laughs> You're at my feet! Really? How can you be sure? Because <laughs> it tickles when you walk around! <laughs> Ivan! You're attached to the bottom of the sea! You're like a mountain! <laughs> oh! Demo! Oh no! Well, that was fun. And now I have the answer to my question. Why don't islands float away? Islands don't float away because they are mountains attached to the seafloor. Upload answer, Debo. Thanks for all your help, Ivan. You rock. Hope to see you again. Anytime. I'm here to stay. Bye bye, Blippi. Whoa, a giant construction site. Let's go check it out. Hard hat area. Hmm, I wonder, why do construction workers need to wear hard hats? <laughs> hey, I'm driving here. Whoa, hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. We were wondering, why do construction workers wear hard hats? Oh, well, hello there, Blippi and Debo. <laughs> My name is Christopher. Christopher Crane, how you doing? Uh-oh, here, put these on. You'll need them. Okay. <laughs> Come with me. I need to bring these beams to the other side of the site. I can teach you about hard hats on the way. Here, here. Construction sites are very dangerous, and a hard hat helps protect your head from many risks. Like, you know, swinging steel beams. <laughs> Whoa, watch out! <laughs> Whoa, that was a close one. <laughs> That's why we gotta be careful, you know? Kareem, how you doing? That's my buddy Kareem, he's a good guy, very tall. Come on. Hi, Kareem. <laughs> 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 Hey, Debo, look out for those pipes. It's a good thing you're wearing your hard hat, Debo. Hard hats are great at protecting your head against bumps, you know? Still got a ways to go. Hop on. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. Look at all those construction workers all the way up there. <laughs> oh. Sounds like lunch to me. But remember, there are dangers all over a construction site. You gotta be careful when walking below workers because you never know when something might Debo! Fall. Oh. All right, stop goofing around. We got a job to do. Let's go. Uh-oh. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Christopher. All right, let's get this job started. Uh -uh. Yeah. <laughs> this is the hard part. <laughs> Gotta line it up just so. Okay? <laughs> hey, look! You helped install the last beam! Yeah! And I got the answer to my question. <laughs> Construction workers wear hard hats to protect their head from bumps and falling objects. <laughs> Upload answer, Debo. <laughs> hey, I got another job to do. Thanks for your help, Lippy. I'll see you later. Bye, Christopher. <laughs> Whoa! That was a gigantic truck! 
<laughs> You're right, Debo. I think that was a monster truck. Hmm, I wonder, what makes a monster truck special? <laughs> Good idea. We can catch up with that monster truck and find out. I'm gonna need monster truck wheels. Monster truck wheels confirmed. Activate Blippi Station. <laughs> Debo? Whoa, Debo! You have the monster truck wheels attachment? <laughs> You're like a monster truck! All right, let's ride! Debo the monster truck is ready for adventure! Crash! Crash! <laughs> It's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. You really crushed that car. Hi, Blippi. I'm Megan. So, Megan, we're here to find out what makes a monster truck special. Cool. Well, I think the best way to answer your question is to show you what I do. Great. You see, I'm a monster truck with big, tall monster tires. I'm 13 feet tall. Wow. Let's go. Do this! All right! <laughs> huh? Huh? Crash! Whoa. Ah. Whoa. We can't bounce as high as you, Megan! And oh boy, we're almost tipping over! Well, I have heavy duty suspension, which are special springs, so I can bounce way up and down and not tumble over. <laughs> I use them when I race Whoa. and have competitions. Cool! Whoa. Whoa. Yeah! Welcome aboard, Flippy! Buckle up! It's time to dominate the obstacle course! Whoa! 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 This is awesome! How can you turn and zigzag so fast? I have something called four-wheel steering so I can turn all four oh. wheels at once instead of just two wheels like a lot of regular trucks. Oh. Us monster trucks are built for short, high-powered bursts of speed. I nailed that! Megan, that was amazing! And I have the answer to my question. What makes a monster truck special? Monster trucks are a special kind of truck with big tires, heavy duty suspension, and four wheel steering. Upload answer, Debo. Bye, Megan! It was so cool to ride with you! Bye, Blippi! Keep on crushing! <laughs> Look at all those adorable penguins! Look at them sliding on their bellies and waddling around! Wow! I think those penguins are flying! Wait a minute! Those aren't penguins! You're right, Debo! I don't see any penguins flying! Hmm, I wonder, can penguins fly? I'm gonna need duck feet and flippers! Duck feet, flippers, confirmed. Activate! Blippi Station! Shrinky down! The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure! Gangway! Huh? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. We were wondering, can penguins fly? Hi, Blippi. I'm Pepper. I really want to fly. I just need to find the elusive Shimmer Stripe Iceberg. The Shimmer Stripe Iceberg? Yeah, it's the biggest iceberg around. Once I find it, I think I'll finally be able to fly. Come on, let's go. I prefer tobogganing over waddling. It's much faster. <laughs> All right. Here we go! Whee! Ice slide detour! I'm gonna catch some serious air! Watch this! Yay! Whoop! Pepper? <laughs> Almost got it. We just need to find the 
shimmer stripe iceberg, then I really should be able to fly. Let's do it! <laughs> Whoa! Not this one. No shimmer stripes here. Whoa! Woohoo! Where could it be? Whoa! It's the shimmer stripe iceberg! Yeah! Woohoo! Here we go! Whoa! Come on, Debo! Yeah! <laughs> All right. Are you ready to catch some serious air? We were born ready! Woohoo! Yeah! <laughs> oh, yeah! Whoa! Whoa, hey, dudes! <laughs> whoa, -oh. whoa, whoa, whoa! Did you see that? I guess it's not the same as flying, but we did catch some serious air. Pepper, you're soaring! I am? Whoop, whoop. You're right. I can really soar underwater. <laughs> Whoa. And I got the answer to my question. <laughs> Penguins can't fly, but they're great swimmers. <laughs> they also have flippers instead of wings, which help them swim through the water. Upload answer, Debo. I'm gonna go catch some serious waves now. Bye, dudes! Bye, Pepper! <laughs> I don't think your guitar is working right, Debo. Hmm, I wonder, how does a guitar work? You're right, Debo. Let's go find out. I'm gonna need wings. Wings confirmed. Activate Blippi Station. Shrinky down! The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure. Great! I love it! Thank you! <laughs> hey! It's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. I'm picky! We were wondering how a guitar works. Can you show us? I can, but I can't work the guitar by myself. I'll need your help to play it right! Okay! When I pick a string... It goes back and forth really fast, which makes a note. Whoa. Whoa. You're right, Debo. My string is much thicker than yours. I bet it's harder to balance for you. The faster the string goes back and forth, the higher the note. <laughs> How do you make other notes on a guitar? That's why I needed your help. Hey, Debo, could you move towards the far end of the neck, mate? <gasps> now back towards me. <laughs> Solo! <laughs> well, that explains how different notes are made. Why does the guitar have such a big body? That's the part that makes it loud! Thank you! Hey, come stand over here on the soundboard! We're going up and down, too! When I pluck the string, the whole guitar body vibrates, and the sound hole there makes it super loud! Huh? Like, a, oh, like shouting while cupping your hands over your mouth! <laughs> Hello! Wow! That was loud! Right! Practice is over. Time to jam! One, two, three, four! Thank, Thank you! <laughs> and now I have the answer to my question. How does a guitar work? Guitars work because the strings vibrate and make sound. 
which is made louder by causing the whole hollow guitar body to vibrate. Upload answer, Debo. Bye-bye, <laughs> Picky. Bye, Flippy. Bye, Debo. Remember to always keep rocking.